Elijah Muhammad touched on all this in the 1930s. That's before anybody talking about it now, even dreamed of it. It was in 1980, I started having personal experiences with it that I became clear on what was my experience at the age of three. Strange thing about all this is that the white scholars and scientists, etc., don't want to face the frightening fact that we black who are descent of the American slaves are aware that we too are Anunnaki and we are the ones who have the answers. They look, we have the answers they look for in vain. It's our information. It's good that they find and learn, but don't close your eyes to the once sleeping giant in your midst. This is a very serious and dangerous thing. So we must view all as one, all events as one to get a total picture. The scripture or holy writings at this time come from a bird's eye view of it all, i.e. what the gods or God is telling us at this time. The scholars must view it as it is. The black man is as the children of Israel, i.e. the light, serious and reviewer, as the Bible story, we were ones in bondage by Satan, as Elijah Muhammad called the blue-eyed devil. All the information they find, it is about us. Not only are we the chosen ones, we are descent of the gods. And where the slave master fit in this story is his original foreparents were created by our foreparents. This is why we went into slavery. We had to pay the karmic debt of our forefathers, the original Anunnaki, for creating and enslaving the Aduma, etc. As it is written in the old script, who holds in captivity will one day again be enslaved himself. So what goes around comes around. So that is what this divine drama is all about. This is why the white man has hated us so, because deep in his genes he knows who we are. But things, the thing about it is, we did not treat him the way he treated us. It is not in, his, in us to hate the white man. I repeat, it is not in us to hate the white man. Faggots like the scholar Ronoko Rashida are afraid of the truth. They will not talk about this. This is a job of the Rastafari to set the record straight. This is a half that has never been told. Like a work of art, a collage, we place events, right information, giving you right information, making a picture out of the many parts. You are now in two now. On the one, the force itself at this time, we call it the Mastery Blaster Jamming. This has been part two of the Supreme Wisdom. Hold tight. We'll be right back in the middle of a storm. Peace.